Okay, here's the video version of the configs that I've been trying to explain. All right, right now I'm scanning an LNF. You can see that all the heads are shown. Chart looks fine. Table display has everything. There's no uh, AUGS inputs and histogram is fully loaded. So all you have to do is exit, go to settings. I have VCM scanner up here as the first one. I'm gonna change the name to L and F so that it isn't used anymore. And I'm gonna take uh, the one that I have as LSA on the end of it, take the LSA off of it. It will now use that one the next time I open the scanner. So open the scanner. Let's open up a log file. Let's load all the data in the histogram. So you'll see it opened up a different window right off the bat. That's the histogram for the LNF that isn't being used anymore. But the ones that I use for the LSA are all there. That's histograms chart display, different chart setup, but everything is there. Let's look at table display, different PIDs, but everything is there, nothing shows unsupported, and there's my wideband, and there's my fuel pressure auxiliary inputs. Everything is there, completely set up already. I didn't even have to change the config how you usually do, go to file and open config. You don't even have to do that because if the config is in your folder and you've used that one the last time you have this set up, that's the config it's going to load. So you can literally have a scanner set up for every engine or car line that you want with a couple clicks. That's it. Bye.